Hey fam, it's Sarah again. Thank you for joining me again today. Today I have with me five different items from Wish that we can try out and something from another Facebook ad. Stay tuned and we'll find out what it is. And let's get right into this. So Facebook and Wish, these items are from Wish, the ones in the white containers. I opened everyone so I could see what it was. Cosmetics, comma, do you? And pretty. Powder packaging. This is an eyeshadow palette, good for 24 months. Kind of hard to see. And it is so reflective. Let's see what it is in oh, the actual shadow. Yes. Okay. Cardboard on the outside. And kind of squishy. Like it's styrofoam. It's not even solid. But I suppose it's cheap packaging. Got it from Wish. I'll put the ad right here. Looks like it does have a protective. They're definitely pretty colors. We'll find out. Looks like there's three mats. Four mats, maybe. Five glitters. Three metal. We'll see how that well that does. It's definitely pretty. So we'll see how well that does. Next item here that I bought from Wish is a beauty blender in it. It's rather on the squished side. You gotta love the mail, but it is only a beauty blender. Well then, popped it back, but it looks like an original beauty blender. Not sure if it really is. And the bottom's broke, I can't see it. The original beauty blender, but who knows if it's truly really a beauty blender since it came from Wish. Alrighty. My original beauty blender right here, which is very dirty, but I've got to wash this one. Bigger than an original beauty blender. This is an original beauty blender that's dry. Size comparison, this one's bigger. So I have 10 in the... The feel is definitely different. This one's softer. This one's more dense. So probably not a real beauty blender since I have one and it does not feel like that at all. But probably for a dollar something. The next item that I have here, I have no idea. I don't remember ordering this. Of course, with Wish, you order things and it comes <clears throat> a month and a half to two months later. And then you've forgotten 
what you ordered. But this, good lord, lasting hydra lip gloss. Good for 12 months. It does have the 12 month. One there. It's nice. Nice face. Okay. Well, try to open this without breaking a nail. We'll be doing well. Mm. Oh. Okay. It fell out. Nice face. That's kind of pretty. Looks definitely plastic, not glass. What do you expect from my pumpkin? Why would I order pumpkin? I don't care for orange. <laughs> okay. I probably ordered something else and got this. I'll leave this one right here. Applicator. Let's see. Orange. Well, it looks like it does dry to a mat. I don't see any sparkles on it. We'll try it. Get that off me. Great. Next item from Wish. It looks like oh, an eyeliner and stamp. Perfected the the art of doing a cat eye with eyeliner yet. <clears throat> Don't do it as much. So this supposed to be. Let's see. Who you guys? Supposed to be a stamp. Let's see if I can do it. Come here. Yeah, see stamp cat eye stamp with this and. And then this end is a pen that you can draw the rest of your cat eye. Ah. Ingenious little thing. I'll leave the link to this, what they call it. Eyeliner and eye wing stamp from EVPCT. So totally cannot pronounce that. What do you guys think? Wow, if you could see it. Huh. I got some serious reflection going on here. All right, so we will. Wow, I just wiped that once.
This is a makeup wipe. All right, that might be major issues. So I'm getting off. That's gonna stay right put. I really had to scrub that in order to get it off. That's gonna stay put, even if you rub your eyes. And this little gem right here, I will put this original ad right here. This is the website that I bought the glitter flip lip sticks from, from Seat London. Right now there is a sale of two for $12. They have a variety of different colors. I bought this one, Forbidden in Dark Red. And I bought this one, Fortune in Dark Purple. It is vegan and gluten free. I do have a little video to it. just as what the video shows. It's not a major amount of glitter, but you definitely do see it. I like it. So if you'd like to get yours, I will link this down below. And this is from Seat London. Wait, did it actually come from London? Let's see. It came from New Jersey. Hmm, okay. Made in the USA. Or at least said from the USA. Let's find out. I know it's a couple flippies. The glitter flip from. Oh, yeah, flip it all right. Eh. The glitter. Supposed to be a glitter flip lip stick. It says transforming glitter lip. Liquid lip. Glitter flip. Can't talk to you, apparently. So this does say it's cruelty free and vegan last 12 months. Nice. I'll have all the links to everything down below. Cruelty and vegan free, vegan free, cruelty and vegan. I can't talk today, I swear. And supposedly you put it on and then you do, mm, and it's glittery. Mm, we'll find out. Let's see if I can do swatches or open these or I've not seen these. Ooh, pretty. Well, that's a pretty package. Look at, look at that. I like it. Packaging is very cute. Oh, I just showed it to you back upside down, didn't I? My goodness. I am not with it today. Still loving that. I have not. Ooh, I got red. Okay, I like red. What was this one? Eh. What does it say? So the red one was called Forbidden. This one's Forbidden. I just like that. And this one, ooh, is purple. It's called Fortune. God. I would totally wear a purple lipstick because purple is my favorite color. Even came with a little paper in it. No idea. Is it supposed to be instructions on how to put on lipstick? I know how to put on lipstick, but wow, different language. Ooh, English. Transforming glitter. Simply apply one even coat of the matte metallic formulation directly on the lips. Let dry completely for one minute and then press your lips together 
repeatedly pressing until you get the desired effect and watch it transform before your eyes into the dazzling full coverage glitter lip. All right. We will do that for a minute. Okay. So I'm going to set these two aside. So excited to get them. Do that. Very excited. We will also try the pumpkin. Try that first. And so we have the eyeshadow, the eyeliner, the pumpkin, and these two to try today. All right. So I've already done my foundation. I've already washed my face. I've already primed. I've already done the foundation. My concealer blush. Can't really see it. I don't do very heavy stuff anyway. And now let's try out this. See if it is even pigmented. I don't know. Haven't tried it. It's brand new. Let's see. Mm, try this out here. And let's try this glitter here. Or metallic. It looks more like a metallic. Let's try this one down here. Mm. Seems to have some good pigment to it. There's one, two, three. Mm, kind of light. We'll find. All right. Well. I think I'm going to start with more of a... Get purples and pinks in here, really. I know, I gravitate towards purples and pinks. Can't tell my favorite color is purple. So I think I'm going to do a transition color first. I'm going to do... Hmm. I'll try this one in the bottom here. We're just going to pat it. Mm, looks like it's got some. Same color. Blending brush real quick. Yeah, that worked out good. And... Do a change color with a brush, and let's say we'll do one of the metallic. I'm just having fun with it today. There it goes. You really got to get in there with it. I suppose what do you expect from Wish? Not like it's a Murphy palette or something like that. 
Not bad color payoff though. In the middle. There and we'll deal with like this really, really, really light pink one here. Instead of just patting it, I'm gonna really get into it because seems like that's the thing. Okay. Need to blend it out and I'll be doing well. That's cute. We could even do a little darker. Blend that out too. Just have fun with it. What makeup's supposed to be. Yeah, that's cute. Color payoff. Mmm, not bad. Can't say it's awful. The packaging is awful. I like the metallicness to the packaging itself. The actual packaging is very wishes. Whole entire thing does. Color payoff on colors and choice of colors. Not bad. Can't say it's the worst one ever. A little sketchy, but it's okay. So let's try this little. Never tried it. I have no idea. So with the pictures that I saw on Wish, I'm supposed to stay up. The outer corner and then use the other end for bringing it in I am not left-handed. Move my mirror just a little bit closer. Well, hello, that's actually not bad. Or the other one for the first time doing it not bad definitely could have different eyeliner i mean eyeshadow not as pigmented as i hoped but so this goes this way in the outer corner of your eyes at least give an outline so that way you can fill it in with this Probably could have brought that up higher, but that's okay. My eye would stop moving. I'll be doing well, or good lord. Ah, not bad. 
Alright, well, for the first time trying it, <laughs> this eye came out better than this one by far. And let's just finish this one off with a little bit of mascara. Yes, my go to mascara still is Avon. Love it. One of my favorites now. I got hair. Where's it coming from? Coming from my head. In my face. Lord. Good stuff. And I'm going to grab my trusty, trusty. Wow, I cannot talk today. Maybelline New York. New York. It's two. Tattoo Studio. Wow. Take that to say that ten times. Beans today. No beans. I like putting a black eyeliner at the bottom. Makes my eyes look a little mm, finished, per se. All right, I got a makeup wipe here. That way we can try this one and we could try these two. I'm really excited about the glitter ones, but let's try this one first. Okay. But it looks like. Not bad. Doesn't have a weird taste. But not pretty smooth. Not sticky. It was, of course I did. It's got a weird smell to it. It reminds me of something. <laughs> Of sugar cookies? It literally reminds me of sugar cookies. Yep. Doesn't remind me of pumpkin. No. It smells like sugar cookies. That's kind of cool. Hmm. Not much one for dark orangey color drying right now it dries matte sticky it was not fully dry yet. it might last all day i'll have to try it sometime i'll try this and do a video of Using this at work, I'll go put this on in the morning before I go to work, and then it, throughout the day, I'm, you know, drinking coffee, drinking Mountain Dew, eating, talking, that kind of thing, going to meetings. I'll test that out. See if it lasts all day. That would be really cool if it did. And I don't mind the color. It's a reddish orange. So I grab my Makeup wipe. Oh, look at that. That might actually stay all day. I just did one wipe with the makeup wipe. 
Well, that very well could stay all day. That was that was an issue trying to get that off. I have a new makeup flight for that in my trash. Because I'm gonna try this sparkly red glitter flip. Such pretty packaging. Ugh. Kind of funny because the lips, liquid lip that looks, it looks purple. It really does. Is this the purple one? But it looks red. In the packaging, it looks red. Yeah, see? It looks red. And it looks. Okay. What's this one? This one definitely looks purple. That'd be weird if it looked red. <sighs> oh no, that one definitely looks purple. I know there's purple in the color red. Oh, maybe. <clears throat> okay, I thought this was red. A little bit goes a long ways with this. The doe foot is really contoured. See how it kind of goes in in the middle? You can feel it. All right, this said, do let it dry for a minute. This said to let it dry for a minute. And then press your lips together repeatedly until you get the desired effect. Literally a minute. Clock on my computer. It's 104 right now. But that's weird how, while we're waiting the minute, it's weird how the inside, from looking from the outside, looks red, but then the actual lip, looks darker. Weird. All right, it's It's got some glitter to it. It was glitter. Not overly abundant. Bleak room glittery. All. But I can tell the difference. That was definitely glittery. Takes a bit to get off, too. Let's see, your curiosity, <clears throat> but the purple one does. 
I'm really excited about the purple one because I love it. All right, let's find out. I'm making a mess out of the deal here. Let's see if this does anything. I can cope. And get as much on the bottom. It looks black on camera. What is it? Very, 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 very dark purple. Okay. See that purple? And that's all dark it is. I like darker lipstick. Just because I like gothic things. I'll let this dry for a minute. And I am gonna get into my wish lashes because that would look so cute with this look I go out tonight yeah mm, all right well we're, we're waiting the minute for the liquid lip to dry I am just gonna get in with this is the liquid that goes with the magnetic lashes themselves that one looks good making sure there's no stuff up and put on lashes in a little while oh I'm just going over the winged eyeliner that I've done before, so you can't even tell. Putting this on. Mm -hmm. 
I am just making a terrible mess today. Goodness. Ooh. There. I'll let that dry. Can't really slide your lips back and forth because it's so sticky. But it did turn glittery. Not as glittery as the pictures that you see. Hmm. The only way you're going to get that type of glitter is go for an actual glitter. And this is that Galaxy glitter from the Ashley Lee Cosmetics. To share just one of it as I'm letting my eyelash stuff dry. This is that other one. It's a powder. Just a little flat brush. I'm gonna grab my matte finish NYX setting spray. Love this one. And we'll spray it this direction. Put some coffee over here. Hmm. Lipstick did not come over. Come on. Get on the coffee cup. So this one very well, very well may stay the entire day too. Good to know. And yes, I just pulled a graveyard girl sippy sippy. I watch Bunny too. Right. So ooh, that's a lot. Let's see. The liquid lip is sticky enough. So then we'll just match it. With some. In the middle. Oh, I'm gonna have to put on. I don't know. Because the glitter had too much fun. I love glitter. Can you tell? Can you tell? In the middle, just on the dark. And yeah, if you get the loose glitter. Loose glitters for cosmetic use only. You can oh, blend that right. Lovely. Oh. All right, on this side, a lot of glitter got on my my eyelash. So it did. It has been my day today. I have to let that dry again, but this is cute. So the only way you're going to achieve 
the sparkly ness of a glitter lip. If you want a little bit of sparkle, hmm, this will do just fine. If you want more metallic, use like a powdered glitter for my cosmetic uses. It will do just fine. All right. Where is it? There it is. Ah, Nag that. One's get me every time because. Rare. Yep, tis my day today. Eyelash. Of course, the wonderful wish. Eyelashes that are magnificent. Sorry, I'm a dork today. Gotta be a dork sometime. Or life would be boring. Oi! French fries. We'll just stick it there and move it. The great thing about these lashes. You can... Just now pop them off. And I'm right back on. Into the right spot where it's supposed to be. Oh, look at that. Not bad, not bad. Added a little glitter to it. So yeah, if you want a little glitter, these do just fine. If you want extra glitter, get the just any makeup glitter. I'll let you do the glitters. Very nice. So that's all I have for you today from Wish and the Yate London. I'm pronouncing it correctly those are really cool I like them a lot even though they didn't have a lot of glitter payoff it's fine I mean I could wear it to work and I wouldn't look out of place too badly um, going out though I would add some glitter to the stickiness which pretty much takes the tackiness of it away that's fine so yeah, that's all I have for you today. Please do subscribe if you haven't already done so. And I will have all the links down below so you can get your own um, different ones that you liked. Have a great rest of your day and I'll see you again.